construct reliability uh, for data extracted from survey or questionnaire in SPSS. Construct reliability is a statistical measure that assesses the consistency of measurement. It indicates to which uh, extend items or questions from a questionnaire uh, consistently uh, measure the same underlying construct. The way to perform this reliability test is to do a test using the Chrompax Alpha. The Chrompax Alpha test will assess the internal consistency for the construct the value for the Chrompax Alpha is from 0 to 1 and a value of equal to or greater than 0.7 is acceptable. Here in this data view in SPSS I had inserted 9 questions labeled from item 1 to item 9. These questions were extracted from a questionnaire and the participant responded uh, by selecting one out of five options. So the uh, response was designed based on a five point Likert scale. If we click here onto the variable view and click on the values, it shows that uh, the uh, responses was labeled from uh, 1 to 5, a value for 1 for strongly disagree and a value of 5 for strongly agree. The first three items measure the first construct, the next three items measure the second construct and the last two items measure the third construct to do the construct reliability test click on analyze scroll down to the to scale and then click on reliability analysis i'm going to reset this window and in this window select the items that measure the construct item number one and two and three drag them to the box here click on statistics Tick for description for items, scale, and scale if the item is deleted. For summaries, tick on means, variance, uh, and uh, covariance and correlation. Click on continue, and for the model, use the cron Bax alpha by ticking on the alpha here, then click on OK, and output is generated as shown here in the first table. There are 201 uh, participants. Uh, there is no excluded uh, cases. And the second table shows the reliability test for Chrompax Alpha. And the value for Chrompax Alpha is 0.79, which indicates that uh, the uh, there is a reliability for this uh, construct and there is an internal consistency between these three items. The third uh, table shows the mean and standard deviation for each item. And the next table describes the item means and item variance. What is important is the uh, next table which is item total statistics which shows that uh, what is important in that table is the Chrompax Alpha if uh, item is deleted if item 1 is deleted the Chrompax Alpha will decrease to 0.58 and if item 2 is deleted it will be 0.76 and if item 3 is deleted it will be 0.78 so this test shows that the, uh, there is a reliability and internal consistency of these items as the alpha value is, is 
um, greater than 0.7 to perform the same test for the next construct then click on analyze scroll down to scale and then click on reliability test drag the next three items into the item box here then click on ok again a uh, output is generated for the second construct showing the valid number of cases the reliability statistics for this second construct is 0.76 which is acceptable so the items that measure that construct shows reliability and these constructs are reliable as being uh, tested by the Chromepax Alpha and if we scroll down to the table here uh, which shows that if Chromepax Alpha uh, will improve if one of these items is deleted if four uh, item four is deleted the uh, uh, value will decrease for item five will decrease and for item six will decrease finally to do the uh, test for the last construct which is the third construct that have in it um, item eight and nine click on ok and an output is generated as shown here uh, for the number of cases and for the reliability test Chromebox Alpha the value is poor as it is 0.24 so this test shows that this construct is unreliable and uh, the items or questions in it need to be modified or changed or uh, added uh, some uh, further questions to it to improve the internal consistency of these items so co construct reliability is an important statistical method to perform to make sure that there is an internal consistency uh, for the construct uh, in SPSS when performing um, analysis on a data extracted from a questionnaire or a survey if you find this video useful do subscribe to the channel leave any comment in the indicated uh, box and activate the notification bell to receive the recent and uh, latest release uh, into the channel of uh, several different video clip and click on the like icon and share the video link with others so the channel can expand and improve to include a large scope of uh, different statistical method and how to analyze data using uh, several different uh, statistical packages such as SPSS, Excel, Stata, Jamovi, R Statistic, or Statistics, Graphpad, Prism, GPower, Python, and RevMan. If you are a student or a researcher and you have a data, whether it is um, um, quantitative all qualitative and you want to perform a statistical uh, analysis on that data using any of the softwares listed here whether it's SPSS, Excel, Stata, Jamovi, R Statistics, Graphpad, Prism, Revman, GMP, Python then do contact me to arrange for either a one-to-one -one private tutor session or a training course uh, on any of these uh, statistical packages my contact details are given here so don't hesitate to uh, write to me or email me if you need uh, a private one-to-one uh, -one, uh, tutoring or a training course